Hey everybody, Kathy here with Pain Porn by Kathleen Miller. How are y'all doing today? <laughs> I'm just looking at you, Phil, and you're like this. <laughs> just made me start laughing. You're goofy. But anyways, I guess he's in a good mood. At least he's smiling behind the camera. That's true. I'm smiling in front of the camera, so you got two smiley faces anyways. But I'm doing 11 by 14, and I'm doing um, the Caterpillar Swipe today. However, the body is going to be in the purples and the cranberries and the golds and the coppers and then his little crawly legs. I got a question. Uh, it, it doesn't have to be flooded? Yeah, I'm going to flood it. Oh, okay. Just so people can see it okay. this time. Okay, all right. And then I have a whole array of colors here. So, as you can see, people have asked to see how I flood my canvas. I don't do this a lot on camera because I just find it... Well, it just adds it, time. Yeah, but, it does. And but if a lot of people do want to see how you do it and how much you put on and so forth. So it's, now is a good time to try that. So I thought, well, we'll just do it once for everybody and then they'll be happy and we can move on. Well, you do also do show it in your recipe video. Yes, I um, do. How you, you, you do your base, how you do your pouring medium and how you do your cell activator and so forth. So if somebody wants a refresher on all that, please go to video 478, 478 and that there is a direct link in the description box to that video oh but this will give you a, a real good idea how much of the plain old paint that kathy puts on and she does a little spinner root to get it even there you go people It's all even. That's all there is to it. It's all in today's work. Done. Okay. At the end of the video? Yeah, it's the end of the video <laughs> okay. now. We're all done. Okay, so I'm going to go over my colors now. My base is just plain white. There's no silicone, no water, no glue in it. You saw how I put it on? So everybody that's been asking, now you know. And I'm not coming to your house to do it for you. Okay, going down my middle for his body, I have Cranberry by Primary Elements, Blissful Bordeaux by Primary Elements, and I have Josanja Burgundy and Dioxazine Purple by Liquitex. Also, I have Folk Art Treasure Gold Copper. I have Dioxazine Purple by Liquitex, and I have Deep Gold by Amsterdam. That's going to be his That's body. That's the caterpillar body. Okay. For his legs. I don't know if I'm using all these, but I'll just tell you what they are anyways. Light Blue by Artist Loft, African Jade Primary Elements, Isadora Bling It, which is the new color art. Now I got my finger stuck on there. Uh, and it's like a yellow diamond. It's beautiful. This is Candy Apple by Primary Elements which is color art, deep yellow artist loft, iridescent green yellow by PBO. This is bling it metal, which is green. This is mandarin blush primary elements mixed with vermilion by artist loft. This is bling it glass wing, which is a peach gold. And I have turquoise phalo by golden and bling it oasis, which is sparkling turquoise. Ooh. Okay. So I don't know if I'm using them all, but he's going to be pretty colorful no matter what. I say that caterpillar, he's going to be styling, man. Oh, he's styling all right, Phil. <laughs> okay, so we're going to get started here. This is our cranberry. We're going to do his body first. I have so many colors, I don't even have room for them. Jeez. Okay, now, on top of him. You should have taken the sticks out ahead of time. Ah, I should do a lot of things ahead of time. <laughs> that is the deep gold. Next, I am putting down, um, where is this? I'm putting down my Josanja Burgundy and my dioxazine purple. Well, that's a mixture then. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ah! 
Kathy does do a lot of mixtures. Sometimes she puts two paints together or two pigments together or one of each. And she, uh, the recipe video that I mentioned will also show you how to do that. See, this way I know what I have already used. Okay. That's a good idea. Well, I don't know if it's a good idea or not, but that's what I'm doing. Okay, and this is our last body, which is Blissful Bordeaux by Color Art, Primary Elements. Okay, there you go. There's his body. So, we're going to move on now to the legs. Okay. The little leggy waggies. I'm going to do a light blue. Should I make him bigger, his legs, you think? I don't know. Maybe a it little bigger. It depends how many, how many legs you want to give him. <laughs> well, he's because a pretty big you, boy. If you're going to put more than one color, it's on each little leg. And I don't care if I have some negative space. That's fine. You know what I mean, Phil? I do. Hey, everybody. If you have been watching, you know I've talked about our baby birds. Well... Okay, on with the baby bird story. So, the baby birds got old enough to leave the nest. Well, the baby birds came back to the nest. They were sitting in the nest together, but they're so big, one of them had to go sit on the side of the tree. So, then Phil and I look out there a couple days later, and there's an egg in the nest. <laughs> I don't think it's from the baby birds. <laughs> no, all of a sudden there's the egg. Well, we've seen the bird in the nest. Today, both baby birds are back. The baby bird is sitting on the egg and the other baby bird is just on well, the side of the nest. You no, know, it's babysitting. I think they, uh, you know, using them to babysit. Parents are tired of sitting well, on them. Well, obviously, they really don't want to uh, leave the nest. I mean, that's a given. Okay, i got to start over here, too. Well, I wouldn't put another blue next to the blue, though, would you? Well, it's a I light don't... blue, but still. Um, I mean. Oh, you want me to use? I'll use. Well, well no, I just use that. I'm talking about maybe one of those, um, those colors, yes. Or the one next. No, I'm going to go here. Okay. I don't even have enough colors, Phil. <laughs> well, you can use them as long as they're separated. The reason that we were kind of discussing the, what color to put down, if you put two similar colors next to each other, it sort of leaves sort okay, of a, do a that. blob of that color on the finished painting. And that's exactly the opposite of what Shoot. we want to happen with the caterpillar pour. With the caterpillar pour, you want a wide variety of colors spread out um, all through the canvas of the painting uh, once it is swiped. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Oh, this is going to be a big swiperoo. Holy cow. I hope my spatula can do this, Phil. Well, we will find out. You got to use the large spatula, I guess. I gotta use something. As you can see, Kathy's puppy pool and spinner have been used quite a bit. <laughs> quite a bit of paint uh, in there from spinning it off. Uh, she does clean that every once in a while. And Kathy does have a spinner and pool setup video uh, that tells you exactly how she sets up uh, her pool, the spinner, how she attaches the sticks, what type of spinner she uses, and how she attaches all her canvases uh, to the sticks. So there's a direct link in the description box 
for the spinner and pool setup video. Oh, I almost spilled that, Phil. That would not have been good. No, that wouldn't. And today we are going to swipe with Prussian Blue. Oh, your cell activator is going to be Prussian Blue today. All right. Yes, That's it cool. is. Okay, and I think we're going to put red down there. Now, I'm going to come back with just a little bit of these blingets. I'm oh, only okay. going to put a, it's on, going to just be on a couple of them. These blingets are from Color Art. Kathy is an affiliate of Color Art. You can get a nice 20% discount on all the products that Color Art offers by using the link and discount code in our description box. These blingets are just what their name implies, uh, adds a lot of bling or sparkle uh, to the finished painting. So Kathy loves to incorporate blingets. And what are the, what's that other stuff that, uh, like your Chantilly lace and so forth? Oh yeah, Chantilly lace. But that, that has a different, um, my, my mind is blank. Chantilly lace and those. Those have, are the prison pores. Prison pores. There we go. I'm sorry I didn't remember that. We've only said it a thousand times on our channel, but um, again, that adds nice glitz and. Oh, it's glitzy. Yes. Okay, we are done. Now, hopefully. Here's the caterpillar. I can. Get this swiped. We're gonna use this big mama. Okay. I think I'm gonna to have to do half. No, nope. well that's fine. Whatever you gotta do. Half and half, I think. I think that that's true. So yeah, I think don't I'm worry about it. Do half and half. Even if or I. Or you can do a little bit of a crossing. No, Take... I do, do want to cross with this because I, I want to do something different. Okay. There's that Prussian blue. Cell activator, it's simply Amsterdam, I believe it's Amsterdam Prussian blue paint, is that yep, correct? that's what it is. And Australian Floetrol. That's all and, it is. By the way, Kathy has a U.S. distributor for Australian Floetrol. You can save 15%. Again, there's a direct link and discount code in the description box. Okay, we're gonna see what happens here. Okay. A nice blue, that's for sure. Oh, we're starting to get some cells popping. Not a lot at this point. But we'll continue on. Hmm, that's weird, isn't it? Well, just... They'll pop. Yes. I think. I might do the black, though, on the other side. You don't want black on the no. other side? No, no. Oh, it's coming up. It's coming up, Philly. Slow but sure. That's for sure. As you can see, Kathy puts a nice amount of the cell activator on the spatula. And it's starting to perk. We're getting some mm -hmm. really nice... Not a lot of cells, but really nice, nice sized cells. Yeah, we are. So that's now, it. that's good. I think I'm going to, I'm going to have to do these. So, well, I'm going to here, do my, uh, here's my unsolicited advice. Yeah. Um, there are other air paintings you've done where you did not swipe everything. And I just wonder on, this, ca leave on this caterpillar, what would happen if you, if you kind of left some of them. Um, I don't know. We can or, leave or, and see what happens. Or do you think you want to do some 
wrecking or I'm marbling? I'm going to do some wrecking. I, I'm going to do marveling. Marveling. I'm going to do marveling. Yeah, I'm going to do some marveling. I mean, that might, might be a little bit different uh, twist to the technique here. It's going to be different. I'm liking these uh, cells coming I up. am too. I like that Prussian blue cell activator. It goes very nicely with the colors you have. I'm just making those little ones come up a little bit. What Kathy is doing is, of course, blowing on the cell activator to try to bring up some of the paints that were underneath. It's going to be cool. Yeah, it's, a, it's going to be, uh, it's different. It's a different caterpillar. Okay. I think we're going to start over here. You sure? You don't want to start Maybe and bring some, yes. Bring some. Got my favorite marble. <laughs> don't lose that marble. Oh my gosh, I can't. Okay. Don't give me any problems here, people. Having fun. You can tell I am because I'm smiling. When you're smiling, when you're smiling, the whole world smiles with you. When oh, you're geez. laughing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I got to turn the volume down on the phone here. Oh, Phil, Phil, Phil. This is what you're married to. <laughs> a goofball. For better or for worse. Hey, it's been good. It has. Absolutely. We can't complain. I think I'm going to be just about done here. Yeah, no, we've, uh, we've had better and worse. We've had richer and poorer. All that's left is till death to us part. Well, that ain't so I hope that's a long ways off. Do you think I sh should... Go down that side, over at the end, through those cells. I don't know. The only thing that, is maybe that area there, I don't yeah, know. I thought I'd go through here. Just go through there. I don't know, I don't know if, if you want to overdo it because if you're gonna do some spinning, we'll have to see what that what that does for you. I, you know, I don't, yeah, maybe just go right down off the edge there. That's what there I want to do. Okay, now this is definitely different because you left those some of those caterpillar legs unswiped. Yeah, and we're so, gonna see what happens to them. I like that. You still have a lot of the central part with the golds and the coppers and the purples. Very nice there. At least we don't have a copperhead. We have a caterpillar. Okay, now I'm gonna just pop some of these bubbles. Okay. And, oh. And Kathy, then we're going to be going. Kathy does have four different shops that you can peruse. Of course, she has her Amazon shop where you can pick up all the supplies you need for paint pouring. She has her Etsy shop, which has all of her original art in there. We just added about a dozen new pieces to that shop. She has a Redbubble shop, which has her images on a wide variety of merchandise. And her Legalerist fine clothing shop, where her images are imprinted on fine dresses and tops and, and pants and so forth. It's really, really cool to go in, click on a image and see what happens. Okay, we're gonna click on this image and okay. see what happens. Click my mouth shut now. Click your mouth shut, Phil. Gotta get some of this mm -hmm. paint off. No, that's fine. Because you still got plenty of negative space. Could still hear it flying. Oh, 
Oh, this is pretty darn cool. <laughs> it is. This is pretty darn cool, people. Pretty darn cool. One thing I don't like is this. Oh, yes. I got to get that out of there. I guess that's how we do it. There was the central body to the caterpillar, the colors that Kathy used, and then you can see some nice vibrant colors that are on the outside of that, which were the dollops there of color go. that Kathy put down for the legs. Yeah, and you've got, got a nice there. kind of a, a psychedelic, funky painting out of it. This is pretty cool. It is. Actually. It is. It's pretty darn cool. I really like this. Well, I like it because it isn't overdone. It has really just a few large cells, very nicely colored. And then it has a few of the marble wrecking lines. So that isn't overdone either. Mm -mm. And it has the unswiped areas, which give it some nice popping of color in different areas. And you have the negative space Correct. to offset all of it. So it, it was kind of a, a nice uh, mix of all those components. I'll tell you, it's really, really colorful. There's tons of color there in this it thing. It's pretty. Let's see here. I'm loving the copper here and the go. golds. And... Here we're picking up the bling, the bling it. The, mm -hmm. As I mentioned, it has. You can really see it here too. Oh yes. And on the yellow. Oh yeah, very nice. And when this is dried and resined, that is gonna It'll sparkle be like really, crazy. Really pretty. I love this. Mm -hmm. So if you like it, everybody, give me a thumbs up. Uh, it was a different type of caterpillar that we did today. <laughs> um, he's still crawling. So um, try it. You might like it. And uh, please subscribe to our channel. We'd love to have you join our family. We love all of you. And we want you all to stay healthy, stay safe. And remember what I always say, it's only paint. If you don't like it, scrape it. Start over. It's only paint. So until we see you again. See you later, alligators, and I'll give you the update on the birds. Bye-bye. <laughs>